quick and really short because it's really simple. This is um, kind of my technique on how to get big voluminous hair. Um, so for all of you women out there that have this hair that is super flat or even if it's uh, not naturally flat but you just want to add some extra volume, this is kind of like my technique um, on how to keep it big all day long because what I show you right now, it should last you until you wake up the next morning. If your hair falls, you are doing something wrong. So um, yeah, this is the way you do it. I mean, it's super simple. Um, so yeah, you can see right here, um, this is my hair, pretty flat, right? And so I will teach you how to make this flat hair um, big and beautiful. So here we go. You're going to need some hairspray and um, just a teasing comb. That's pretty much it. I think I got this for like um, maybe a dollar ninety nine at Sally's Beauty Supply. You should be able to pick this up pretty much anywhere, any beauty supply store. But um, okay, so um, part and all of that good stuff. It doesn't even matter right now. Um, just this is my hair curled from you know early this morning. It's just kind of loose. So um, starting, I always start right here at the crown. And what we're going to do is you are going to take your first little section of hair um, about, mm, let's see, a little bit thicker than that. I don't know if you can see. And honestly, I mean, this video is, it's so simple to do this. Um, again, this is just my way, my technique. This is what I do on all of my clients. Um, you, if you have another way, you can do it. But if you have tried every which way and you cannot get it, this is probably, I would say, the best way to get a tease in your hair that you can't see from behind. I mean, nobody's gonna stand behind you and see, you know, a rat's nest. It's gonna look beautiful. And anyone's hair that I've ever taken this way has told me that they can wake up, pretty much pick it out, and it's good to go again. So, again, this is just my way. So this is your first section here, and this is about how thick it is. See that? Not too thick. When I comb through it, you can pretty much see through it, which this would be perfect. This is the first section that you are only going to tease. You're gonna stick this comb in, push down. You're only gonna do this maybe twice, and that's it. We want this section to be the section to cover up all of that mess that's going on underneath. So that's the first section, just once and twice, and that's it. Throw that forward, okay. So moving on to the next section here. Let's see, I'm put my head down. Next section. Um, if you, this is a good rule of thumb, if you can see through that, that is a perfect section to tease. If your hair is a lot, the section is a lot thicker than that, like this, good luck getting it to hold, it's going to fall. Simple as that. You have to think of it like this. You have to build a base in here. Once you build that base, your hair is not going anywhere. Your volume will hold. Build a base and after that, you're good to go. So, again, you just want a section small enough that you can kind of see through. So, if you can't see through that, that's still too thick. So this would be a really good section, maybe even a little bit more than this, but I'm gonna go ahead and use this. So now you're gonna stick it in, push down, stick it in, push down, and just repeat that. A couple times, a few times. Throw that forward. You're gonna spray, and we're gonna spray and leave it this way, and we're gonna do the next section, and leaving it this way is basically, it molds it this way, so when we throw it back, your hair, again, is not going anywhere. Next section. Everyone is different. Do however much you want for volume. I love big in, hair. down, in, down. And you just keep going. Pretty simple, right? Spray. It molds that way. 
next section. Remember, the thicker the section, I guarantee you, if you don't, if you do a thick section, your hair will fall midway through the day. If you take a section thin enough, you're going to create a base that is not going anywhere. I promise. So this is what I do to my clients. And this is how I teach my clients. Okay, so, you know, it's daytime. I'm not gonna go too big, but if you're going out, it all depends on you again, um, what you like, how much volume you like in your hair. If you absolutely love crazy big hair, you're gonna keep going. You're gonna keep building and building however many sections you wanna do. Um, I'm gonna stop here. What was this, like couple, I just, I don't know, three, four sections. I'm gonna stop here and, um, if you want more volume, just keep building. So here's what we do. We're not going to just throw all this back because if I just toss all of my hair back right now, I'm going to end up with uh, still a mess. So the best way to do it is the section I last teased, which is here. We're going to bring this down and fix it. See how I fix this. Fix it. Looks horrible, right? Okay, that's okay. Spray. And you're almost gonna push up like this. Smooth it and push up. Next. The next one I did, I think it's this one or I might have two in there. Yeah, I think that was a few. Okay, so you're just gonna repeat this step until you get to the very top. Smooth it out just a little. Spray. And now here's that first section we did in the very beginning. This section, you're gonna lightly comb on top. Okay, I still have some T's in there. Lightly comb on top. This section lays over everything that's underneath. When I go to do this, it makes it look very pretty, but yet I have all this going on underneath and no one can see it, which is nice. No one wants to stand behind anyone and just concentrate on the back of their head because it's crazy rat nest right there. Sorry, but I mean, that's exactly what it looks like. So, um, okay, so this is going to smooth over. So you fix that on top. And I, I push like this before I spray. Just a little bit. I'm not big on hairspray, so just a tiny bit. And um, there you go, teased hair. From this point, you can, you know, style like you like. Um, I have these crazy hairs I've had all my life. They just want to stick up. I know. Um, and then I like to just take a little bit of pomade and, um, you know, something light, not too thick. And then you can see all those little hairs and then just smooth everything out. And I will show you the back so you can see, I'm not kidding, it looks perfect. See that? Big hair, you've seen it in the beginning. You know, and this is kind of like I would wear it for daytime. I'd probably go a little bit bigger, you know, I was going out, it was nighttime or whatever. So again, so yeah, I mean, pretty simple. I mean, you just have to remember you build a base. Build your base and everything will stay in place. If your section is too thick, when you tease it, it is going to fall midday. And like I said, I promise you, this will last you until you go to bed and wake up the next morning and then the next morning, guess what? You can do just a little pull back and your, your tease should still look almost intact. You know, you could do a messy pony on your third, fourth day of dirty hair, messy pony, you know, and your hair should still be intact. So, I mean, yeah, I mean, it's pretty, it's pretty simple. Once you get the tease down, I mean, you know, you can do any hairstyle and it will look good. I mean, if you have the right tease, you know, and it looks pretty, 
I mean, you're, you're going to be able to do anything with your hair and it's going to look good. So anyways, yeah, guys, I hope you like this. Please uh, comment below. Let me know, you know, if there's anything else you want to see. Um, but yeah, I mean, pretty quick, simple, easy, and I mean, anything else, you know, just let me know and hopefully I can help. Thanks guys. Bye.